Welcome. This is our tutorial. It goes all into our Workspace ONE to Intune Migration Utility, which can do all that on a PC without even having to wipe it, which is foundational for a lot of companies making the move. So let's get started. So you can see here I've got my smart group for the migration. I'm putting my machine in there. Then I'm going to hit Next, and I'm going to publish it which is going to deliver that package down to my machine. So let's switch to the machine. Okay, so what I like to do here is do a little sync, help kind of usher it along a little bit. And just because I like to keep an eye on things, let's go to my trusty friend, Program Data, because this is where you're going to end up seeing in just a few moments the Intune Migration folder, because once you see that, you know, things are starting to get underway. And there's that folder, which means that we're in business. So at this point, this means in the next couple minutes, we will see the machine powered down and start the cycling of reboots that usher in us into the new world of Microsoft Intune. So here you go, there's that first reboot. So what then you'll notice with this utility is we give you the information you need. So it tells you here your machine's being migrated and it's gonna automatically reboot. So I don't do a thing, I just watch this and I hang out. Cause you know what, you don't really have anything to do. So there's that reboot, and that is underway. So when we come back up, let's see what we see now. So now it says, sign in with your email address and don't do anything else. It's just to kind of move the process along. So you can see here, I'm going to log in with my account, get everything initialized. You can see here that I can see my avatar from Office 365, which means that the reconnection to enter went well and that we're in good shape. So like I said, don't do a thing, and you're going to see why in a second. See? There you go. You're about to be signed out, and that is why you don't do anything. So here comes our next restart. So now, as we come back up, it says, you're all done. Please sign in. And so I'm going to do just that. I'm going to sign in. And now I will go set up Windows Hello. This is like any other Windows Hello setup when you first get your PC. Now, I'm an Octoshop. That's OK. Don't hate me. I'm going to do this whole little push notification thing to get myself underway. But you Microsoft Authenticator friends, same deal. No big deal. So it's going to log me in here because we all love Windows Hello for business. I'm going to create our pin. Easy peasy. Hit OK. And we're in. And note, my apps are still there. Didn't lose anything. All my data is still here. But the question is, did I get enrolled in Intune? Why don't we find that answer? So we're going to go to Access Worker School. The little drop down. Let's hit info. Look at that. We are indeed enrolled in Intune. I was a little worried because I didn't see the Intune management extension yet, but sometimes it takes a little bit to do its thing. And that's perfectly okay. We can give it its time. One other thing that we do like to do is we pop into logs and we're going to be looking for a, a log file called post migrate. That's when you know the final step of things are done because the post migrate tasks will do things like setting the primary user, which is really important from an Intune perspective. And so we're just kind of waiting for stuff to finish up.
And there we go. There's our, our Microsoft Intune management extension. And now we're just waiting for that last friend of ours to come in and join the party. There he is. Post Migrate is there. And you have completely successfully enrolled.